manna for February 24th. For what the law could not do, in that it was weak through the flesh, God, sending his own Son in the likeness of sinful flesh, and for sin, condemned sin in the flesh, that the righteousness of the law might be fulfilled in us, who walk not after the flesh, but after the Spirit. Romans 8, verses 3 and 4. What comfort and consolation are in these assurances! These are wonderful words of life indeed. They inspire us with hope. If God will accept perfect heart intentions, as instead of the absolute perfection of the flesh, then indeed we have hope of attaining to the standard which he has marked for us, the standard of perfection. We can walk after the Spirit, though. So far as our mortal bodies are concerned, we cannot walk up to the Spirit's requirements. Our minds can walk up to the Spirit, our intentions can be perfect, and this is what our Heavenly Father seeks in us, perfection of intention. The text again. For what the law could not do, in that it was weak through the flesh, God, sending his own Son in the likeness of sinful flesh, and for sin, condemned sin in the flesh, that the righteousness of the law might be fulfilled in us, who walk not after the flesh, but after the Spirit. Romans 8, verses 3 and 4.